Welcome, I am Mislid, and today we're going to check out a promotional demo of Franbo. This is being made by a couple out of Sweden. They call themselves Kill Monday. They are currently raising money to finish this game um, over on Indiegogo. It is a, as they call it, a very creepy point-and-click adventure game. So let's get into it. This is our entire options right now. It's a demo, so I mean, you know, settings aren't exactly what you're going to get. Let's go. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents. They look happy. That's nice. It's a good little nice adventure game. They have a present for me, I wonder. It's a cat, so sweet and pretty. That's nice. Dark as the deepest night. Uh-oh. It's an evil cat. It's Mr. Midnight. That's good. Looks like a nice cat. My best friend. My only friend. Oh, that's kind of sad. Come on now. We're having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace, too. Hi, Aunt Grace. You look happy. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Leave me with a cat. Oh, Aunt Grace takes good care of me. We're having so much fun. That's nice. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. This is not going to end well, is it? But something feels really bad. Uh-oh. Oh, snap. It's a demon. A strange creature outside my window. Mm-hmm. I don't like it. It scares me. It should. Look at that thing. Suddenly, I hear something. It's Mom screaming. Oh, shoot. I want to know what's wrong. Well, I, that's... I guess it makes sense. A heavy light shines from my parents' room. This is not going to be good. I go closer. And closer. Uh oh. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Oh! S snap. That's brutal. Got some rose. Got they are mutilated. Okay. House is bleeding. Yeah, run away, little girl. Girl fell down. Cat's kind of comfort. That's nice. Oh, see something. Cat's mad and scared at the same time. Are you the killers? Are you a, what are you a traveler with a cloak on? You Aragorn come to get us? Fran, please follow my voice. To the to the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Three. All right, we are. Fran, how do you feel? I'll find a guess. I feel like dying. Okay, so he's like a doctor or something. He's gonna want us to say nice things. Let's not freak the doctor out. I'm fine, I guess. Just sad to see the same. Oh, don't admit you see the same crazy nightmares you just had. Sadness is something everyone has within. I want to find the killer. I want to go home. I want to go home. Let's not talk about our vengeance quest. You can't go home, friend. You have to get well. I am well. I need my cat. I'm not mad. Uh both of those. Let's go with I'm not mad. But I'm not mad at all. Let me out. Don't drop the let me out part. Come on. You know we cannot do that. Because I'm an adult and I know better. But now I've got something for you, Fran. Ooh. Oh, really? Well, that's like sarcastic. Oh, really? You got some needles, don't you? See, the desk, there's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. Oh, excellent. We like her. Okay, so I'm assuming that's this. Alright, so now we get probably control of something. So we okay, so you don't get cursors over what's clickable. We saw on the desk, I assume it's this. Gotcha. But this is a demo, maybe for the base game you'll get like the cursor change to say, hey, you can click on this. Instead of having to do a hidden picture. Open it, there's something inside. Alright, click it again. Here we go. Lost and found. Here's our inventory management, I guess. 
Use combine examine. All right, so we click. Okay, so that's what we selected, and we will examine it. Dearest Fran, here's the purse you like so much. I thought you would appreciate it. I was thinking of you, that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. Give it a good use. Never forget that creativity is the most greatest gift you have. You can drop the most there, guys. Love Aunt Grace. Maybe Aunt Grace is just not perfect with her English. Which is also perfectly fine. She's worried about you. Yeah, because I'm in some crazy hospital with crosses on the wall. I'm worried too. Don't say that. Aunt Grace. Aunt Grace? Well, another reason let me go. Yeah, let me go live with her. Well, don't worry about her. She's fine. Then why'd you bring her up? I'm so tired of this. Can I leave? Can I leave now? Can I go? Yes, you can leave. Before you do, it's time for your new medicine. Oh, no, that's more accurate. What medicine? Yeah, cross your arms. I don't like that either. It's called duotine. Duotine? It'll make you very lax. Nurse! Hi, nurse. Anything new today, Dr. Dern? Nothing, actually. Some visions as before. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, friend, take your medicine. What is this nonsense? Give me those pills. Oh, instant sleepy. I don't feel good. Can't give me pills. Guess not. Oh, what? 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 <laughs> the girl, what the hell was that? Oh no, take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Right? Forget those pills. Those are some demon pills. Beware, Franbo. A bull demon. If you leave the house of madness, you're gonna get me? I will hunt you. Like you're hunting me now. Catch you. I don't wanna be caught. And bring you back to insanity. But well, that sucks. Crying blood over here. Fran, wake up. Medicine will help you escape. Wait, the medicine I just had? The crazy demon medicine? I'll be waiting for you in the forest. Crazy demon medicine help me escape? I love you. It's a nice cat. I like your cat. Except he just told us to take demon medicine. What in the world? Chapter 1. Sober Day. So there are five chapters in this game, according to their Indiegogo page. Um, it's only one game, though. It's not going to be split up like... Uh, Telltale's Walking Dead was split up into chapters. It's five chapters, but it's all one, one base game. All right, let's get up. I'm still here, hideous place. So we're in a insane asylum or something. Have to get out of here. I guess up on the walls. Let's look at things. Oh, those are crazy looking. All right, let's look around this room. Hope this won't fall. My head while I'm sleeping. I know, right? You should probably move that like over the table or something. Patient number, name, Franbo. Age 10, sex, female history. The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum, showing signs of hallucination and depression. The patient is receiving treatment with Dr. Dern. We have tried different medication and all has been canceled because of side effects. 25th of uh, Oswald. Okay, so we're in Oswald Asylum. Which is great. Just look up, I'm not that floppy. Not that flop, I don't know what that means. Not that sleepy, maybe? I don't know. Have some water locked. Good reason to get curious. Yeah, it is. What's in there? What's this do? Look it. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. One more time. La la. la. Okay. So same. It's the same as before. Oh, you got bored of that quickly. You look at her face. All right. Oh, holy moly! Something fell. A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Salmon it. A golden hook that fell from the curtains. Okay. Look at this thing. Demon faces going on here. Wow. Alright. Scared of this. Okay, so we got a lock thing. Got some oats over here. Got some drawings or something. Red and tiny, you are hiding from me. A23 D56. Oh, so this is a number cipher. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay. G is 7. H is 8. It gotcha, okay. Letters, letters, letters equal numbers. Number, I hate the monster with the mask. 
Okay, so in case you didn't grasp what's going on there, it just tells you letters equal numbers. Gotcha. We'll probably need that in a minute for some combination. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Alright, so he needs a medicine. That I'm not, that they said never give me again. Hey, can I walk over here? So with these two? Okay, these get to take you between rooms. Gotcha. Alright. Got a wheelchair. I thought that was uh, cobwebs at first. It's like a shawl or something. My legs are just fine. Yeah, stop trying to make me do this. Got a box. Hide. Oh, this is our uh, letters is numbers thing. Okay, so this is four. This is five. What is H? Eight. There we go. Ooh, the pills. The pills. Kitty told me these would help me. Alright. Scared of those pills at the last time. Let's look around for some more first before we mess with those pills. Oh, Wood Mr. Horse, are you having a good time? Back and forwards. Okay. Good night, moon. Good night, trees. Let's go. He looks sad. Oh, a secret box. Shh. I'll get it. A wooden box. It's open. So use it. Oh, yeah. Key. This will certainly open something. Probably that drawer over there. It's the only thing I've found that's locked so far. This bear. I hope someone loves you. Ah, that'd be nice. Crayons. You got crayons and uh, some paper. Paper, indeed, very white. My favorite green crayon. All right, let's uh combine this with the paper. I don't know what to draw right now. Okay, so that does work. We don't know what to draw yet. Gotcha. 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 Scrap this doll. You used to have a blue dress like yours. But then I went to the nut house. Alright. Phil Brinestone, eight years. Hallucinations, right? Yeah, hallucinations, okay. So this chair, we'll go talk to Phil. If I sit down, I eventually get up. So what's the point? That's okay. That's I mean, okay. Hello, boy. It's <laughs> probably a little meaner than it should have been. Hello. No only way out. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Phil. Everyone says that I'm sick. You look sick. Look, you're about to pass out and die. All right, Phil. See, you. poor you. No way out. Let's talk about me, because I don't really care if you're sick. To be honest, yes, the office is the key. The office? Yes, the office. You know where you meet the doctor. Oh, how do I get in? How do I get inside the office? It's a great question. He doesn't want me to tell you. I don't care who wants you to do what. Be independent, Phil. Who doesn't want you to tell me? Oh, there's Arrow. Him. Come on now. Who are you pointing at? Oops! Alright. What the heck? All doors are closed. You're a prisoner to, of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Ah. Shh. Leave me alone. I hate you. No joke. She does not freak out as much as I would right now. I'd have, like, fallen over. I mean, the first time she passed out, but still, I'd have fallen over and been like, Oh my god, I'm gonna die! Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. That's no joke. No, I want that monster to stop me. Oh, now she's determined. Try to kill her. Alright, let's use our key on this thing. Use. With the drawer. There we go. Yes, I did it, and there's something inside. We got some pictures. Oh, I didn't mean no. That's not what I meant. I mean, examine the photo. I will find my kitty and then go to you, Aunt Grace. That's a nice little family unit right there. Um, this examine. What is this? My hair grip. I should give good use to it. Oh, it's like a hairpin or something. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Let us. Actually, uh, let's use these pills. <laughs> well, we'll see. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna do that lot, I think. It was not me. What the crap? This is a dead rabbit. 
Oh, are you sleeping, sweet bunny? Sleeping? It's like covered in blood around here. What is this half a child with no hands? Unpleasant nightmares, no thanks. What? Well, yeah, it's unpleasant. That's the same thing for already. Okay. Wow. I don't even... Nothing else changes, right? Actual descriptions of this kind of stuff? Can't fix it. Okay. Let's get out of here. So it only works in one room. Okay. Let's... Do it again. Mm, oh. Okay. Watch your steps. Nothing special on the horse. Wood Mr. Horse, are you having a good time? Don't play like there's not blood everywhere. <laughs> Hello, Miss Nurse. She's so calm during this. Are you alright? I'm not alright. Who cares about the nurse? Hello? Huh. Ah, psh, I don't even know. How about this right here? Can I have a string? Excuse me, lady nurse. This may be very useful. What is that? A crochet needle? Small and sharpie. This could fit somewhere. Okay. Ignore that for now. Man. Alright. Well, that kid's gonna die. Get away from him. Oh, oh, he's got a shade with him. Two happiness out the door. And there's a deer. What? Oh. Alright, now. Uh, <laughs> Alright. I'll try to put your head back on. I'm sorry, I can't help you, Mr. Deer. I'm trying to put his head back on. Leave him be. He's a dead deer with his head chopped off. Is your mouth sewn shut when you're eyeless? That's creepy. Can I not click anything here? Nothing to click on. It's just like, you know what? This is crazy. Of course it's locked. Okay, so if I got... um, she's a hairpin in it. Lock pick. Fits with there are two holes and something else. Okay. So I got this thing. You switch the door. Almost where there's another hole. Needs to, okay, you gotta combine them, maybe. Combine with that. Gotcha. Now, are you on special key? Alright, yes to happiness. Alright, let's ignore that man for a second. Go in here. The throne is empty. I didn't realize anyone can just see me pooping. Gross. I can't and will hold it. I, mm, that's like a good and a bad idea all at the same time. Alright. Cross is still in the nut house, give you hope of should not, you know, hope of something, I guess. My little girl, I can't reach it. Damn it. That's what I'm sure that key is for. Office door locked. How obvious. Uh, well, it is kind of obvious. Hey, Mr. Man. Hello, sir. Can I ask you something? Of course, little girl. What's on your mind? How do you not know my name? There's like two of us here. Open the door for me. If you direct, you should open the yellow door for me. Why is that? Because my cat is outside. And I want to get it, and then run away with it. Sorry, girl. Even if I wanted to open it, I can't. It's alarmed. You're the guard. Who can open it, then? Help me out here. Some people mean some people. There's a code, and that's almost impossible to find. Who has the code? Help me out. I won't tell you, and I leave. I'm reading here. It's impossible. You don't tell me where it is. That's like it's actually impossible. It just sounds like you're being a jerk. Alright, so he's not helpful. Let's go in the kitchen. In the kitchen, let us... Look at this robe. Can I steal something from it? This pink rope is mine now. Ha 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 ha. Open the robe. Get to tie things together. Okay. Let's talk to this nurse. Hello. Oh, hello, friend. How are you doing? Thank you for knowing my name. I very much appreciate that. I see dead animals, or if I am fine. Don't admit to seeing dead stuff. Don't admit it. We will lock you up, give you more drugs. Glad to hear you're fine. Carry on now. Open the nurse. Can you open the other door? No. It's not very appropriate to ask. I have to ask you to leave to your room now. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say anything inappropriate. Very well, friend. Go now, please. Go play with your friends. I don't have friends here. People are crazy. People are, like, proper crazy. Alright. Hello, girl. I don't know her name, either. I can give you the magical stuff. Shh. Why? Don't say no. Of course I want the magical stuff. What kind of pills you got? You know it's whatever drug she's supposed to be taking, right? The magical stuff that'll make everything fall asleep. Ooh, what do you mean? I would definitely take that. 
Ooh, everything? Here, as a gift, just take it. Excellent, it is a pill. What is it? It's a pill makes people sleepy. Come on now, that's what she just told you. The magical stuff to sleep. Shh, shut up. Don't let them know. Don't tell them anything. I love toys, but nothing really interesting or useful here. Maybe I can search again? Nope, nothing good in here. Okay. Huh, I wonder what's inside the bottle. I don't know. Mommy said paint roses. Well, that's sad and depressing for this table. I'll take something. Mm, piece of cake. Alright, how about... This is cake, just regular cake, right? Taste the cinnamon bun. Okay. Can I put... I'm sure I got drugged somebody. Like, I'm not going to eat this. Can I put this in the cake to give somebody litter? This is a magical cake now. A sleepy, sleepy cake. Sounds good to me. Alright. Probably get to the guard outside. We want to leave. How this bird? Anything? Birdie bird. I like you. I like him too. Have these grapes? Nope. Let's talk to Mr. Bowlcut. Go away. Don't disturb me. I'm eating. Alright now. I'll steal your cane. Don't touch my sword. I didn't know it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I'm your king. Are you? You're not my king. I just go along with his delusions. I bow to you, sir. I'll play nice now. Farewell, my child. What is the purpose of your visit? I want your cane sword thing. A walking cane. Do you mean my sword? That does seem a rude thing to ask a man. Can you just give me your sword, buddy? Yes, your highness. Yes, your highness, your sword. What would you give me in exchange? I don't know. Anything you need. It's an awful thing to say to an NPC, but okay. Bring me a castle and a horse, then you'll get my sword. A castle and a horse. There's a uh, horse in the other room. Alright, so we got a quest from him. Let's talk to this obese little child. Hello. The nurse is dead. What nurse would that be? Because I just talked to a nurse a minute ago. Bloody meal, bloody foodie. Don't eat it, then you're creeping me out. But I'm so hungry, bloody meal, red and raw. You are you are disturbed. I mean, both answers are not really good here. Oh boy, we have a disturbed mind. Yep. That's all we got for him. The show of the day, the same of tomorrow. All right, let's let's go look at our. Uh, there's a horse in the room. Maybe we can grab it now. I don't want to really drag that all across here. I have not seen a castle. We can do something with this now that we have. Yes, maybe. Ooh, would he? Would Mr. Horse? Are you having a good time? So we can't grab that. Okay, let's go back out here. And I hate to do it. Start popping pills. Well, dead people. We tried to leave. Wow, he's dead too. Little girl can't reach you. Okay. Oh man, dead girl with a bunch of rats eating her. The king likes drawings. Oh. Okay, the king likes drawings. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So we can draw a, a horse and um, castle. Yes, there we go. And give this to the king. Fantastic. Fantastic. Okay, let's, let's use our pills some more. Ugh. Ooh, hide your pain. The nurse is dead. Check that out. Foodie boy was right. What's this letter? Don't use it. I mean, examine this. Blanca, if you need to go out, turn off the alarm. The door will open. Set the clock on right time. Enter code on the computer. 3642. Okay? 3642? We'll remember that. Well, I probably won't. I'll probably look at that note again later. Another ghost. Are you hiding? Hello? Why won't you talk to me? So, okay, the kid has a shade. She's also dead, looks like. But not as dead as the nurse. I see she's sitting up. Alright. Pills. 
they are dead. So everybody here is dead, or I'm insane as well. His eyes are sewn short, shut. Woo. You should sit straight. Your back is real bad. Are you giving, like, posture lessons to the shades or ghosts, whatever they are? So you like TV, too? All right. This room's crazy. Can I think we can go normal? Yes. Okay. So, let us give... Because that stuff's crazy. To this, to our king. He's happy about this. Good. Oh, that's beautiful. Exactly what I dreamt of. That's nice. You can take my sword now. It's yours. Because now I got a castle. So, I am good. All right. So, we're going to use this cane to try to knock that uh, key off the wall, right? I feel like that makes sense. I feel like that makes sense. Use this up here. I can reach it, but now I can't pick. The, but I can't pick up the key with only the stick. So I got to combine it with something. Hook. And this perfect. I need something else to tie them together. Okay, there we go. Combine it with the rope. Now I can use the rope to try to hook to something. And combine this with that. Now I can reach high. I'll call this Grabomatic 2000. Fantastic. Let's use it. What? I will stab you in the gut. Hey, you give me that. You can't take that key. I really need to open it. I don't need to open the office door, please. Can't. Just wait for you to leave then. What? That's some. Tell the enemy your plans. I will never leave this chair. Alright, so let me give you my sleepy time cookie. Hope we can be friends. For you eat it, boy. Hope we can be friends. I'm sorry. Oh, what's that? It's a cinnamon bun that I will call a cake. It's a cake. I thought you would like it. Oh, that's very kind of you. Thank you. Boom. Out cold. Give me my staff back. Got time for your games. Use with the key. Super. Now I can go inside. Oh, yeah. Or, oh, yes, I guess is what she said. <laughs> now I can find the alarm and shut it down. All right. What's... What we got here? We got a clock. I love to open mail, but this is not for me. So, it might sound interesting. Okay, so clock, flowers. Oh, what's the right time? You are blue, and my eyes too. Silly stuff. University of Irwin's Doctor Dern. He's got a diploma. That's something. Something I need, not really. Boring medical papers. Okay. Oswald oh, Asylum computer. Checking the clock. Connecting to clock. Checking. Set clock on time. Pending. So it's waiting for me to set the clock. Okay, close that. What's the right time? Alright. Let's use these pills. Wow. I Beware of the time. What is the name of your cat? My cat's name is Midnight, Mr. Midnight, to be precise. This is insanity right there. I kind of love this game. I'm just going to throw that out there. I kind of... This is such a good... Like, I don't... Just... Ridiculous mechanic. Because with most characters, you think like you're in an insane asylum, right? Which you're not really crazy. You're just in the asylum. You've got to escape. That's why you've got to escape, because you're not crazy. Everybody else is crazy. This game's like... Look, maybe you're not crazy, but you take these pills, you are nuts. You are straight up tripping balls. All right, so we can change this clock. Yeah, there we go. So does that move the hour? There we go. Okay, it moves the hour. So we're going to midnight. Just circle this around a while until it moves us an hour to at a time. There we go. Okay, midnight. Excellent. And it clicked for us. Well done, Fran. Well done. Excellent. So it goes past the connecting the clock, checking, should be right, hopefully, wait, set clock on time, done, awesome, alarm active, enter password to activate system, what was the password, 3642, does that sound right, anybody else, 3, 
and it moves other things. That's annoying. Shoot, hold on. Okay, is that right? Wait. I should look again if I'm not. Oh, good, that's right. Alarm deactivated. Oh, yes, I am the best. True, true facts. True facts. Garso out. Alarm is green, so it's off. It's got to hear. It's running away. There we go. That's the demo. I really like this game. Um, like I said, this is still a... This is an Indiegogo account. They have not reached funding. They have another 52 days from the time I'm recording this um, to you know reach their funding goal. They're trying to raise $20,000. It is a fixed funding goal, so you have to, it's like Kickstarter. You have to raise all of it or they get nothing, I believe, is how that works on Indiegogo. You should check them out. I'll put a link in the description. Go support this game, Franbo. Very, very creepy, very creepy point and click adventure game. It's a couple out of Sweden. I said, I'll put links in the description. You check it out. Go give them your monies so I can play the rest of this. I mean, I, you should play it too, because, but really, I want to play it because this is kind of amazing. <laughs> I am missing it. This has been Franbo. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.